Alright, here's what I'm going to do. Uh, today, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to show you what not to do on Cockatrice, or what you can do. So I'm going to join a random person's game. Something I don't usually do. Normally I just play with friends. And joining bucks this guy is inactive. Um, I don't think this guy is active. Uh, this is just one of the random things that happens on this program. This is why you usually just should test with friends. Because, first off, you don't know who's active, who's inactive, etc. Okay, this guy is probably inactive, so I'm just gonna leave this game. Try someone else's game. Alright, so let's try this person's game. Okay, I think this guy is also inactive. This should get it. Okay, yeah, he's inactive. Okay, let's try someone else. Do, 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 do. You know how it also takes a while for people to figure out that I'm here. <clears throat> there goes the neighborhood. Oh, here we go. Alright, let's go ahead and load a local deck. Okay. So I'm going to go first. This hand is decent. Uh, yeah, I can keep this. I'll probably make some mistakes since I usually don't like to talk and play at the same time, but yeah, what happens, happens. Alright, so he's playing Dark Slick Shores. Despise. He's probably going to take my squad. He is going to take my squadron hawk. Alright. So now it's up to me. Now my hand feels a little worse. Yeah, it definitely feels worse. I play that and then just pass the turn. <clears throat> so there's a chance this guy might actually know what he's doing, in which case you guys get a good game. Yep, this guy is playing Dark Blade as well. We're officially in a mirror. So I'm going to go ahead and play my Stoneforge Mystic. See if I can find my swamp. Here we are. And let's go in and get Sword of Feast and Famine. Alright, so I got Batter Skull in hand and some other good equipment. Two preordains to Doom Blade, and I don't have a single blue source. So I guess we'll be seeing what happens. Alright, so that means I get to untap. Well, at least I get a land. Not exactly the land I wanted, but it's a land. And I'll just pass. And he's gonna play sword. And if he puts sword on it, I'm probably just going to doom blade it. If he puts sword on it, of course.
To be quite honest, I still actually prefer... Uh, hold on. He just needs to know. I probably shouldn't have told him, but it eh, doesn't matter. Not right now, I mean. Still. I have War and Peace, Batter Skull, and I have all my equipments in my hands, so. Sure. So I'm playing against a competent player, so that's good for you guys. And for those of you who like Dark Blade Mirrors, congratulations. <laughs> this should actually be a fun game. Play Batter Skull. I go. I drew a land. It's a blue source as well, so that makes me happy. Um, let me think for a moment. I think I just go in for the attack. Pass my turn here. Yeah, next turn I could put War and Peace on it and start doing some heavy damage. Unless he has a way to kill my guy. Yeah, I'm going to Doomblade it. Sure thing. I probably messed up in the beginning of the game by not mulliganing, but so far it looks like it might turn out okay. <clears throat> I mean, I still have a really nice hand. Although I probably should have not Moonblade and just kept mana open and used Stoneforge. Because now we can get him for three. I'm going to discard preordain. Okay. Sorry for any crappy call quality there might be. I'm not sure if this is a very good recording thing, but so far it seems pretty nice, and it's worked out in my last few videos. Alright, um, we can do a lot of stuff here, like play Gideon and stuff. Hmm. Sure. Peace. Now let's go ahead and get the planes.
Alright. Well, let's attack. He, he's got to bounce the germ, otherwise the germ will get through either way. Doesn't bounce the germ. Okay. Um, that's it. I'm in pretty big trouble here. Is that a Gideon or Jace? I'd be scared if it were either. Yep, it's the Jace. You can bash in for five here. Probably going to play my hawk next turn. Well, I definitely am going to play my hawk next turn. <laughs> so I think he still has one more hawk. Yeah, he still has one more hawk. There's a hawk. go Gideon or something nope pretty dang. yeah you can still play Gideon and he took my other hog. Which makes me sad. If he arrests me, I'm in big trouble. Although I think I just put the sword on my um, Stoneforge. I don't want to lose feet since famine, but I don't have a choice. And let's attack him. And that's it. That's all I can do, unfortunately. He can still bounce my guy, which makes me sad. Over when it's that we record and record. 
He's playing another Jace. Oh, he's using his. Okay. Thought he was going to use mine. I have to get rid of the sword here. Alright, so I drew my Dark Slick Shores. Which doesn't help. Hmm. Oh, that's my turn. I probably need to put Mortar Pot in this deck now that I think about it. Okay, so he's bouncing my guy. Hmm. You should ask for stuff, but just taking it by yourself. Dude, give me my mic back. Okay, I think he just plainly wins here. Three, six, seven, eight. I think if there's any other options I can do. I don't see any other options. Oh, you already conceded for me. Alright, so the Divine Offering will go in. So we'll Jace and Despise. And out goes... I don't like Sword of Peace of Famine in the mirror that much. <laughs> These two are... Okay. Hmm. The judgment is fine. Uh, I think I take it into the royal. Anything else I may need? I think I might need one more day. Uh, I think I'm good. Alright, this hand's mediocre. Yeah, I'm gonna mulligan this. Oh, I can't get it. I don't want to mulligan to five with this.
Yeah, that's good. Let's go. Alright, he's just gonna pass quickly. I'm gonna actually play Inquisition cards like first. I'm gonna take Stoneforge. That's it for me. Sure thing. I have a day of judgment in my hand, so if he does play a Maria, I'm not too worried. And if I can get double planes, that's good. Double white, I mean, I'm sorry. Oh, that's land, at least. That seems good. So we have Squadron Hawk, Samaria Angel, times two, and March Flats. He still has a land. Probably gonna get his black source. Or just another white source. That doesn't help. Oh, Pierce, he might have? Alright. Alright, so he does have another land. So here comes a Maria. I need two white sources now. Hi. <sighs> I'll still probably put this video up. Either way, good games. I mean, unless I draw two white sources somehow, I am not going to win this game. Yeah, that tar pit is probably going to end the game. We all make mistakes like that. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed.